Hello again, Ken Van Lu here. I enjoyed our previous conversation and I'm eager to dive deeper into the modern wealth building formula. We've already pinpointed an effective strategy for your goals and now it's time to delve into the specifics that await you. For our upcoming session, I've prepared an hour's worth of insightful content tailored to further our conversation. I urge you to give your undivided attention to every moment of this video. The insights shared here are pivotal ensuring that when we meet for our significant session, we are primed to maximize every minute. Our objective is to avoid spending valuable session time covering these foundational concepts. Now, before we embark on this transformative journey, please allow me to offer a gentle reminder given the significant value associated with this $695 consulting session. Our policy includes an honor system that if you cannot make the meeting, you contact us either way to cancel or reschedule under any unforeseen circumstances, please. My passion lies in empowering lives and delivering tangible results. It is with reluctance that we implement this policy, but we must uphold respect for the time we both dedicate. Therefore, prepare to take some comprehensive notes. Not only will this serve your understanding, but it will also facilitate a more productive dialogue. As we engage fully with the session's content, you'll find that achieving your financial aspirations is not only possible, but an attainable reality. Today, I am thrilled to share with you a journey into mastering real estate investing through a powerful approach known as the Modern Wealth Building Formula. This formula isn't just a set of strategies. It's a roadmap to transforming your aspirations into tangible wealth through real estate. As we dive into this journey, remember the essence of wealth building in real estate isn't found in a single deal, but the knowledge, systems, and mentorship that guide you every step. So what are we going to cover in the next hour? We're going to talk about the power of real estate investing. Real estate stands as one of the most robust avenues for building wealth. Its tangible nature, coupled with potential for capital appreciation and passive income, makes it an unmatched arena for investors. However, the path to success in real estate is laden with challenges, intricacies, and a steep learning curve. That's where the modern wealth building formula comes into play, offering a beacon of knowledge and proven strategies to navigate the complex market. Now there's a pregame preparation that lays the groundwork. And before we explore the three pivotal phases of the formula, let's talk about the foundation's pregame preparation. Like any significant endeavor, success in real estate begins with the right mindset and a solid plan. This preparation phase is about equipping yourself with tools, knowledge, and the mental readiness to identify and seize opportunities. It's about setting your goals, understanding the market, and aligning your resources. It's what I call a new sensory acuity, and we share a quick lesson to open your thinking to unrealized opportunities. Remember, preparation is the key that unlocks the door to opportunities. Phase one, find discovering opportunities, is the first phase of the modern wealth building formula, and it's finding the right deals. But how do you uncover these hidden gems in a saturated market? This section will delve into the strategies for identifying lucrative opportunities, the importance of market research, and how to leverage your network. We'll discuss the critical role of mentorship in this phase, helping you sidestep common pitfalls and save invaluable hours that would otherwise be lost to trial and error. Phase two, fun. Securing and funding the deal is when we identify the potential deal and then the next step is funding it. This phase can be daunting, but with the right knowledge and strategies, it becomes manageable. We'll explore various funding options from traditional loans to creative financing and how to choose the best fit for your deal. This is where accountability and having a proven system play crucial roles. They ensure that you are not just taking calculated risk, but that you are also positioned to make the most of every opportunity. Phase three, facilitate is executing and managing the deal. This is the final phase in facilitating the deal from acquisition to completion. This involves due diligence, project management, and ultimately executing your exit strategy. Whether it's selling for a profit or holding for rental income, we'll cover the importance of systems and managing your projects efficiently and how mentorship can provide you with insights and confidence needed to navigate complex transactions and market dynamics. By applying the principles of the Modern Wealth Formula, investors are equipped with the knowledge and strategies needed to navigate the complexities of the real estate market from identifying opportunities to executing deals successfully. 
This approach not only enhances individual deal success, but it also contributes to the broader goal of building lasting wealth through real estate investing. So here's my promise to you. If you stick with me, I'm going to hand you a step-by-step -step strategy to execute your next real estate deal with both professional and personal success. I understand skepticism, indeed. I welcome it. Skeptics often start with nothing but stand to gain the most because they challenge every premise, validate every step, and in doing so, cement their understanding and potential for success. Once you unlock the proven framework of the modern wealth building formula, you will embark the journey with several benefits. You're gonna to learn to identify and leverage opportunities in real estate that others overlook, how to navigate deals with no money down, harnessing the art of negotiation and financing, build a portfolio that grows in value, providing not just immediate returns, but long-term security, how to develop a network of professionals who can amplify your success and provide expert guidance and to transform skepticism into confidence as each step of the formula proves its worth in real world applications. And then you achieve financial gains and satisfaction of mastering the craft that could benefit you and your family for generations. With this formula, you'll move beyond conventional paths and tap into strategies that have been refined through both triumphs and setbacks. It's not just about the money, it's about creating a legacy of wealth and knowledge that stands the test of time. Embrace the skepticism for it will be your ally and together we'll turn your questions into actions and actions into results. That's the power of the modern wealth building formula and it's within your grasp. Allow me a moment to introduce myself, share my story and convey why my insights can be instrumental in your journey to success. I am a recognized authority in the realm of real estate, leading the forefront as founder of Global Real Estate Strategies. It is here that we don't just invest in properties, we innovate, develop, and construct the landscapes of tomorrow. My academic background is rooted in engineering with, with dual Master of Science degrees from prestigious New York University and New Jersey Institute of Technology. Beyond academia, I've challenged my knowledge into literary success penning the best-selling book, Modern Wealth Building Formula, which demystifies the complexity of real estate investing. Today, I stand before you as more than just a mentor in the real estate business. I'm an international speaker sharing my expertise on stages and a best-selling author whose writings continue to empower aspiring investors. Why should you listen to me? Because I've navigated the very paths that I now light for others. My commitment is to mentorship, to impart knowledge that transforms ambition into achievement. So let's embark on this journey together and kick off on our next call. Now, let me tell you my story. I had a slow start. Life's journey has been a mosaic of ambition, family, and determination. My tenure as a captain of the college football team was marked by triumphs on the field, yet it posed its own set of challenges as I juggled the rigorous demands of civil engineering studies. I actually had hair and balancing both spheres taught me valuable lessons in discipline and time management. Marrying my college sweetheart was a turning point. Her unwavering support and knack for imparting study skills were a pivotal point to my eventual success in mastering engineering concepts. Together we navigated the complexity of academics and personal growth laying the foundation for my future endeavors and a beautiful family. Navigating the New York City construction industry laid the groundwork for my real estate ambition. The birth of our third child in 1996 only fueled my resolve and by 1997 I was poised to establish my own company. It was two years of rigorous preparation before taking the leap into real estate. At the age of 38, the foundation of the modern wealth building formula was set during my first venture, a 90 unit assisted living project valued at 14.2 million. Success continued on the Park Avenue with the development of 100 luxury units, part of 1,500 units and 3 million square feet of commercial space that would culminate in over 1.3 billion of New York City real estate achievements. As founder of Global Real Estate Strategy, our record of 137 deals in one year stands as a tribute to the relentless spirit that has been my driving force since my college days. Today I look back only to see how far I've come I live a life once dreamt, now realized, a testament to the power of resilience, the grace of serendipity, and the unyielding belief in the possibility of transformation. The success of the modern wealth building formula wasn't a stroke of luck. 
It was a repeatable strategy that proved itself across numerous deals. This triumph wasn't just a personal victory. We continue to do deals as it has been a blueprint for success as I knew it had to be shared. Thus, I poured my knowledge and experience into the pages of what became a bestseller, Modern Wealth Building Formula, How to Master Real Estate Investing. The book was more than just a narrative of success. It became a catalyst for change. Today, I have the privilege of mentoring hundreds of clients and guiding them through the intricacies of investment and development in the real estate world. Witnessing their growth from novices to savvy investors has been one of my greatest rewards. It's not just about building wealth. It's about fostering a community of learners and leaders who will continue to drive the industry forward. Understanding the significance of this consulting call can make it the most transformative conversation of your life. It might seem like an exaggeration, but here's what I mean. Let me introduce you to my partner, Brooke. When she first approached me, she was cleaning houses and harboring a dream to invest in real estate. Young and in need of guidance to unlock her potential, we worked to organize her life and strategize her first real estate deal. Today, she has successfully acquired her fourth deal, including two multifamily investments. Let's listen to a few of her words. I signed up for Ken Van Lu's real estate training program a little over a year ago. And within six months, I was already buying my first investment property. Today, I bought his book, I love his book, that encouraged me to get started. So I bought my first property, I wholesaled it. Shortly after that, I found another investment property that I wholesaled. And then recently, I bought my first long-term hold in my hometown, and that's going great. And actually tomorrow, I'm closing on my second long-term hold. And I would like to make a shout out to Ken for getting me started and encouraging me to start and take that leap of faith. I really encourage a lot of people of different levels to to take on his mentorship program because I think he can help everybody. Consider Brooke's experience. She had the same breakthrough session that you are on the cusp of experiencing. The insights we shared with her during that call catalyzed her journey from frustration to running a thriving business that she's passionate about. She has now achieved the freedom to enjoy life in a way she had always desired but never attained. So ponder this, where would Brooke be if she had skipped her breakthrough session? That single conversation, the same one you were scheduled to have, radically and powerfully altered the course of her life and has been worth hundreds of thousands of dollars to her. Had Brooke missed that call, it would have cost her over a million dollars in the long run. Beyond the financial impact, she found happiness and fulfillment for the first time in years, both in her business and personal life. This is why I emphasize the importance of showing up to your breakthrough session. I encourage you to commit the opportunity wholeheartedly. Let's take a moment to delve into the story of Tom Fortenberry, a figure whose initial skepticism about investing in real estate could have cost him a fortune. Tom is a consummate professional in the legal field with an enviable track record of success. However, the concept of acquiring real estate with no initial financial outlay seemed implausible to him, a notion perhaps too good to be true. Here's what Tom had to say. My name's Tom Fortenberry, and I'm a real estate attorney, and I've been working with Ken for several months now in his lifetime coaching program. During that short window of time, uh, Ken has inspired me, and he's challenged me to overcome some of my own limiting beliefs. I used to think buying properties with no money down was something for other people. Since working with Ken, I've been able to acquire multiple properties with no money down, seeing the radical shift in my own way of thinking to think bigger, to think about how to how to get outside of myself so that I can move forward in this real estate journey. If you're on the fence, if you love real estate, if you're interested at all in growing wealth in real estate, I highly encourage you to join Ken and his real estate family. You won't be disappointed. Thank you, Tom. Our partner, Jeremy Faberel was a financial advisor looking for a career change after their work environment shifted from working at home with family to going back to the office. He joined our community and quickly gained the knowledge and courage to make the jump into real estate. Here is his excitement after his first of three deals to date. So how's it feel? Uh, I'm, I'm, first of all, so freaking relieved today that, you know, <laughs> the, the ink is dried, the keys are in my pocket. Um, and, and, you know, Olu, you mentioned like you had a conviction after watching all these videos um, that Ken's posted and, and 
this community is it is the dream team that Kim talks about. Our esteemed partner and friends Raven R has graciously offered to share some of his remarks. One of the main reasons I actually run this firm is because I was able to speak and meet with Ken Van Loo back in 2008. And just, just to show you proof that I'm not a paid actor, here's my original workbook from, from that seminar, how to uh, find, fund, and facilitate large New York City real estate developments. And I'm, I'm just some kid from Trinidad that grew up in Brooklyn that, you know, I, I, we didn't grow up in wealth. We didn't, I didn't have connections coming to Manhattan and, um, people to show me how to do this. And Ken's system gave me that. How am I gonna raise a hundred million dollars to do a real estate development if I have zero experience? And Ken shows you step by step how to get that done. Ken's given you templates to use to get your first deal done. Um, the, the, the most important thing that I, that I really got from it is that you can really create anything that you wanna create. You know, it all started with me meeting Ken Van Loo, and I'm super grateful and super blessed, and I thank God that you know I've met him, and I'm actually working with him closely now on a, on a couple of deals, and you know I just I really hope that you find something in this for yourself. A few other people you may know thrilled to share this moment with Jack Canfield, the illustrious New York Times best-selling co-author of the Chicken Soup for the Soul series. His endorsement graces the front cover of my book, testifying. I know a billionaire that uses Ken's formula. His support is as invaluable as it is inspiring. Captured here is a moment with Dolph DeRoos, the distinguished New York Times best-selling author, mentor, and cherished personal friend. His gracious contribution of the forward to my book and his invaluable mentorship were the guiding lights that propelled me into the exciting world of commercial real estate. Here's a snapshot of an unforgettable moment en route to dinner in a luxury comfort of a limousine with none other than Robert Allen, the New York Times best-selling author of No Money Down. His insights have been a pivotal force in my journey, living the dream shoulder to shoulder with a true catalyst of my success. Grateful for every moment spent with my mentor, Tony Robbins, a transformative New York best-selling author who profoundly changed my life through his Master University program. After an intense and insightful journey of Date with Destiny, wealth and life mastery training spanning one and a half years, I've had the honor of rising to become a senior leader as his events across the nation. So it's time, let's pull back the curtains and reveal to you the phases that have changed people's professional and personal lives that you may not be doing. The modern wealth building formula delves deeply into the strategic approach to real estate investment focusing on the fine, fun, and facilitate phases, each critical for achieving success in the real estate market. Here's a synthesis of these phases and the pregame preparation required, along with the benefits they offer for real estate success. The pregame preparation, which I mentioned before diving into the three Fs, there's an emphasis on the importance of the pregame preparation. This preparation involves mindset conditioning akin to a sports preseason where the aim is to get investors warmed up, in shape, and ready to tackle the real estate market efficiently. This preparation includes exercises for mindset acuity, setting investment goals, and defining investment criteria, ensuring investors are mentally and strategically prepared to identify and capitalize on profitable deals. Find, the first step, find, involves identifying profitable real estate deals. This phase is about leveraging a prepared mindset and clear investment criteria to spot opportunities that you might overlook. The ability to find the right investment is portrayed as a fundamental skill that requires clarity, vision, and a well-defined strategy. This phase benefits investors by providing a systematic approach to discovering and assessing potential deals, therefore increasing the likelihood of investment success. I wanna show you a quick video about some of the finding skills that we're gonna teach you. Module one, lesson three, finding profitable real estate deals. Now this is a five wide right end zone pass you know, to just go for it, right? Because it's easy to find deals in real estate. The key is finding profitable real estate deals. Now we're gonna talk a little bit about how, to, how I find deals and how I believe 
it should be approached. Now, this is different than what you've seen, and, and I don't think many people do it because it's a formula that no one knows about quite yet, and you're one that are here today with me, so you get it firsthand. I relate everything to sports, and the first thing related to finding profitable deals is the pregame. The pregame is so key. I talk a little bit about the pregame in my book, and the pregame is screwing your head on straight, the mindset. The mindset and preparation meeting opportunity, right? No one's lucky. Luck is preparation meeting opportunity. You have to believe that you can do this. The pregame on what you want to do, the vision, you want to get clear on your vision. That's why we walk you through the modern matrix. If you're involved and you're doing certain deals now, let's find out where you're at or where you've been or where you're at now, where you want to go. We want to pat yourself on the back because you may have had a pregame already. If you haven't had a pregame, you know, and you don't have the confidence to move forward, the first thing we're doing and as, as, you, as we get into this is we're going to be doing confidence building exercises because the whole key is finding profitable deals. Now, the pregame is preparation of, of many different items that we're going to get into and we're going to, we've mentioned about the scorecard and all of these items are part of the pregame preparation in your warm-up. And the next thing after the pregame is, and this may sound unusual because this is not the typical way to find deals, is it comes with a shared experience. Now, what do I mean by that? Now, we're going to be talking about dream teams and real estate deals and all kinds of things related to real estate, but it really comes down to a shared experience. Now, why am I saying that? Because when you have a shared experience with someone, whether they're a realtor, a broker, a finance, you build a level of rapport that in most cases leads to business for a long time, right? Because successful business is mostly done on relationships and it all starts with a shared experience. So I always tell people, you know, when you're going to take the steps of bringing someone from hello to yes in any business, whether it's to find a deal, whether it's to raise money, whether it's to enroll them in what you're doing, it has to start with the shared experience. From that shared experience, there's a formation agreement amongst you two to merge ecosystems. And when you merge ecosystems, you now have a common goal to achieve, right? Realtors may want your business where they're going to go out and find deals for you. The next thing you know, you've leveraged some of your time and they're actually looking for deals for you. And once you do this with several people, you start to merge ecosystems with dozens of people on your dream team that leads to what I call as a program. And the program could be many, many things. It could be a program to buy a hundred homes. It could be a program to buy multifamily. It could be a program to do real estate development, wholesale, fix and flip, commercial. And going into that program, you want to have what I call, because certain things are going to happen as you go into the program, you're going to meet more people. You're going to exer do exercises to, to find out if your models are working. You're going to work on your presentation, your hot sheets, your deal analysis. Part of this program, you're going to put together additional tools for your tool belt so that you can polish that program and put systems in place so that you have all the mechanisms in place, you have the program, you have the systems, you have the finding, the funding, and the facilitating ready to find those deals. Now, this is just a pregame, but I want you to think about what I'm talking about because this is what takes your sources and brings your sources to another whole level. There's tons of sources, and what, I'm, what I've talked about up to this point has nothing to do with the sources because the sources and the deals are unlimited in my opinion. You may think differently. What is limited in my opinion is the resourcefulness and your limit is based on your limiting beliefs, right? If you're not going to have the resourcefulness to reach out to the sources, you're not going to get anywhere. There's thousands of realtors throughout the country. 
they're all looking to find real estate for you, but they're going to find real estate for you. They may bring, you know, one or two good deals. You may have some brokers that are, that are going to help you. And you know, they may bring you some deals, but are they bringing you good deals? Do they know what your project criteria is? Do they know about your son? Do they know what your why is? Like, I don't know if you understand what I'm saying, because when you have that level of rapport, people are watching your back. They want to understand what's important to you. But the only way you're going to get people to want to make a difference in your life is when you make a difference in their life. And the whole key to finding profitable deals, this is the key. You have to give more value than you receive. That is the key. After identifying a potential deal, the next step is to secure the necessary funding. This phase involves understanding various financing options and strategies to ensure that the investment can proceed. The manuscript outlines different funding sources, including private lending, hard money loans, and institutional lenders, offering a comprehensive overview on how to navigate the financial aspects of real estate deals. The benefit of mastering this phase is the ability to execute deals efficiently with the right financial backing to maximize returns. I'd like to show you a video here on how to analyze deals so that you can determine whether the deal is financially feasible. Module three, lesson six. Today we're gonna focus on fixing and flipping. And I'm gonna actually work through a few projects for you and show you how I look at it. And, and we'll take it from there, but I wanna just show you the, the little bit of a paper napkin that I started with. And I mentioned that earlier in another lesson and how we lead into a, a quick analysis, which essentially is a paper napkin. It's your first step to see if you want to go into the investment and it enables you to really see what's happening, you know, at stabilization within, you know, less than 30 minutes. So let me share my screen here today and uh, show you what we have. And then we'll take a look at uh, a few deals that I want to present to you today. And uh, we'll go through and we'll talk a little bit about, you know, tracking cost, et cetera, and, and how, you know, I take a look at, at the deal. So the first deal we're going to look at today is a deal. It's one four seasons. It's in Flemington, New Jersey. And this was a, this was a beautiful home. We picked it up for $360,000 and we, anticipated that the ARV was going to be 520,000, a nice spread. Now, when we used to do these types of deals at Flipping USA, we would create two revenue streams. So we would start off by wholesaling the deal to ourselves, and then we would go ahead and fix and flip and, and create a second revenue stream. And that, that was the beauty of you know, what I thought the formula, which, which really made it work for so many people. So let's show you a little bit about this model so you can get an idea. And this model kind of follows suit. But at the top of the model, you know, you have your property data. Now, most of our properties we used to buy through the sheriff sale. So you'll see that the sheriff sale bid is referenced and as is value. And, you know, the 20 percent on that is, is what we used to have to put down as a down payment. And everything's relative. But the idea of this analysis is to create an offer price. And if you could see in line 17 and 18, you could see that the range of this value that should have been purchased was between 304 and 339 based on a certain brief calculation that we do. And it's just a rule of thumb to kind of see where you're at. Now, in this case, we paid a little bit extra, but the ARV was high enough that it made us work. Now, in this case, we actually wholesaled the project to ourselves. So we purchase was, uh, we bought it for 340. We sold it to, you know, little groups that we would form in, internally so that we can capitalize on a second rate of return. And in this case, you know, just on that wholesale, the guy that had his money in that made 20 grand on a small little deposit, his rate of return for that period of time was 314%. So the rates are absolutely spectacular, you know, when you take this approach to wholesaling, but also I want to show you on this approach how you can syndicate that. Now, this was a wholesale transaction to ourselves. We're not even going to actually get into the wholesale transaction because it's a pretty straightforward rate of return. But I just wanted you to understand the magnitude of it. 
because I really like wholesaling it into a new entity, profiting, but then making a second profit. And that's really the key of the formula. So here we get into a, an analysis, and this is the retail analysis, the fix and flip. So we first look at the buyer transaction costs. And in this case, since we were basically doing a simultaneous close, we had very minimal buyer transaction costs. The next thing in every deal that you want to do is, you know, essentially you always want to look at the land cost, the hard cost, that's your construction cost, and the soft cost. That's like your architect, your holding cost, your interest, your taxes. And these are the items that you want to, you know, find out what you're going to carry during that period. You're going to be paying property taxes. You're going to be paying insurance. You have all the utilities you have to pay for. <clears throat> so you're, you know, you're generating, you know, a, a total project cost, you know, so to this point, the acquisition, the purchase price, plus the buyer transaction costs, plus the repair costs, we're already up to $376,000. Now we look at what the loan amount, if it's an 80% loan to value, just to calculate what the interest is going to be over that period of time. Once you determine that, you then look at what the seller transaction costs are going to be. And in this case, you know, you're, you're all familiar or maybe not realtors fees. So here we were paying about four and a half percent. And there's a number of other fees, the conveyance tax fee, the escrow legal selling recording fees, home warranty, staging costs, marketing costs, miscellaneous selling costs. All typical transaction costs, which equaled almost $50,000, $50, pretty, pretty substantial. But now you get into the retail exit strategy in the box at the bottom of the screen here. I'll just scroll up a little bit. And here we had an estimated net profit of $134,000. And this retail period, as you can see, was going to be for 178 days. So the way that you look at this, there's a little breakdown here where you could see it's 520,000 was the anticipated market value. Purchase price was 351. Total buyer transaction pulled from the top, if you recall, is the 1,850. The estimated repair cost was 14,850, which we'll look at in a second. Total financing cost, 7448. Total hold, holding cost, 9,900. And then your seller transaction, actually, which was 39, I made a mistake. It was adding the 19 over here up to the 50. That we have a subtotal cost to turn this project over of 416,000. So the 520 minus the 416 gives you the $134,000 profit. Not bad. Now, if you're flipping that, um, you know, there's, there's a, you know, a split of the profit, but, you know, also you get to raise money so that your return is substantial. Now, in this case, there was equity requirement of $68,000 and the cash on cash return was actually not 50%, but a hundred percent rate of return, right? Actually, 35% net yield and a 50% cash on cash return. That's if it's 50% profit going to the investor. Because if you can see, this is a two close to a, over a 200% return, actually just under 200%, right? Because if you divide, if you see here, if we were to divide the 134,000 <clears> divided by the 68, the rate of return is 198% there. It's pretty phenomenal. But these are the kind of deals that you could use with the formula because you, know, you would not use your money here. So the equity would be brought in by another party. And I'm going to show you a little example when we get into the waterfall. So let's go to a, a property here where same setup, this is 731 Front Street, Denellen. This property was purchased at 172,000. We had an ARV of 270. Now, and these are just the smaller deals that we've done with the formula, just to kind of show you, we're gonna get into the larger deals after we do a little buy and hold analysis because a lot of the principles apply across the board, whether you're learning this as a finance major down, we all know that it all applies and 
people have to see the connection and connecting the dots between the different analysis. So we're going to do this a couple times to give you some flavor here. Same setup. Here you could see we had much more expensive transaction costs, but the purchase price was 172, ARV 270, balance, you know, of the sheriff sale with 40 down. Actually, we bought this for 160. Here was the same thing where we sold it to ourselves for a small profit. We used to have a little formula. You could see what the, the balance was. You know, when we bought this, we had a potential retail profit desired of 50,000 and we were supposed to pay somewhere between 142 and 148. We were paying a little bit higher because we were making phenomenal returns. But here we had $10,000 in buyer transaction costs. Same, same cost, you know, same expenses for holding costs. You can see you're now starting to see some repetition. The next expense that we calculate is the finance. Now, here you can see between the acquisition cost of 172 purchase price, 10,000 of total buyer transaction costs, and 5,400 of total holding costs, the total project cost was 223,000. So, with that number, Let's see what the financing was. So we had about another, uh, looks like 24000 no, $8,000 in carry costs. So basically buyer transaction holding and finance costs, another $24,000, which now you're getting into sub pretty substantial numbers and another 17, which brings you. So here's a deal that was a little thin and we were actually going into it with a buy and hold analysis, but we, we got stuck flipping it and we only made $20,000. The good news, it took three months. It didn't meet our criteria, which was $10,000 a month. This happens sometimes. However, the rate of return wasn't bad. We had a 31% rate of return, but based on the 119 day retail period, the rate of return came out to 92%, which wasn't bad. So here you can see um, it was a split in the equity it was a 31%, uh, basically that 94% return, which we each received. And that's how that worked. This is how it all starts, you know, starting with estimates that determine unit prices, jobs, where you start to collect data, history of projects, where you start to get a correlation. You start to establish rules, rules of thumb. But this is beautiful. I mean, it's just a basic sheet keeps track of your material payments, any trades, any fees, any labors. It also has a timesheet. A lot of times you'll have labors. They're all getting paid different rates, but you can keep track at all times what's going on. It's a real simple procedure. These are just little spreadsheets that we brought down from, you know, ideas from New York City, building skyscrapers. We're going to get into, you know, some of the big stuff, real exciting. We're going to get into more of the buy and hold analysis and how you can create extraordinary returns. We're really, really excited to show that to you. But today, we wanted to take some basic principles. I wanted to show you the spreadsheets that you're going to get and, and just get you excited like I am to go out there and buy real estate. There's going to be a tremendous opportunity. There's In real estate, it's always the greatest time in history. And I, I just want to reinforce that. Go out there, learn how to do some basic analysis. Surround yourself with some smarter guys. In, in my case, I'm, I'm good with developing, but I have people that do my underwriting because, you know, it's all about the credibility and, uh, and people that really know how to keep track and measure and hold you accountable. And that is the key. So let's, let's get ready and move on to, uh, on to the next lesson. It's getting exciting here. Make it a great day. I hope you enjoyed that analysis video and let's dive into the facilitation process. The final phase, facilitate, covers the execution of the deal from start to finish. It involves due diligence, closing the transaction, and managing the property or developing the project effectively. This phase ensures that all aspects of the investment are handled proficiently from the initial offer to the final stages of the development or resale. The ability to facilitate a deal smoothly translates to reduce risk, cost savings, and ultimately a successful project completion. I want to share a video with you now that will tell you a little bit more about the facilitation process. Module 5, Lesson 4, Formula Facilitation. I'm so excited. I'm 10 times more excited that we are now into the facilitation process. I'm going to show you how I did it. The $17 million project 
using other people's experience and other people's money. I still don't know how I did it back then, but I figured it out and I've done a lot of heavy lifting since then to bring you to this stage so you can do it. And I'm going to walk you through it right now. This is the original Bridgewater loan package that I created. And I'm going to tell you the story around how it was all developed. And this is a key part on how it really worked. Now, the loan package was obviously related to funding. I told you a little bit about how I found this deal. It was through making phone calls and through my presentation, which led me to the point where I had the opportunity to prepare the Bridgewater Loan Package. And I want to show you that right now. So the Bridgewater Loan Package starts with this incredible summary. I just want to blow this up a touch where you could see on page one here, we are actually evaluating the loan to value options for financing so that we could determine what the best equity strategies were. And we were in a situation where the New Jersey EDA was financing this package. So they were lending almost 90% of the money. But in the analysis, as you can see, we looked at a 70% loan to value, an 80% loan to value, an 85% loan to value, and a couple other factors. Alongside of that, you could see what we've shown you, which is the stabilization snapshot. You could see at the top part of the diagram, it shows you your income, what your expenses are, what your net operating income is. Your net income before debt service gives you your total development cost. And then it analyzes the sensitivity related to the loan to value. This is beautiful setup. This could be used for assisted living, could be used for hotels. And then the next tab is the, is the Performa. The Performa, once again, was a snapshot on the first page. This table is a little bit different where at the bottom, it gives you the total return, the cap rate, the cash on cash yield, loan to value, and your debt coverage ratio. This is what we taught you in module three, which is utilized in the final loan package. Then we look at cash flow. You have your annual revenue, as you can see here, laid out by the different rates per unit, how that is annualized over a 10 year basis shows the expenses, what your other expenses are. Once again, ties into the NOI, the prior sheet that I just showed you, remember is the snapshot, then you get into the cash flow over time. First you look at annual, and then the next you look at the monthly, right? Monthly cash flow related to what your debt service is gonna be. And if you could see at the bottom, it keeps track of the cash flow. And you could see here in the first year, we were actually a million dollars in the negative. And that's the reason why a $14.2 million project borrowed $17 million during that stabilization period when we were bringing people into the facility. But it was so important that we had that extra funding because if not, then you won't be able to reach stabilization. This is the building of the project on paper, as I mentioned to you, right? All projects have to be built on paper. I may not have mentioned it to you, but I'm going to start to mention it to you and talk to you now. What I did on this project is I calculated before I started what the hard cost was. So for example, if you look at this next tab, hard cost, it literally shows you a trade cost for each specific line item relative to a square foot cost. This is used at the beginning to establish your budget. So when you start to do your buyout, you can literally compare it immediately against what you originally anticipate as your hard cost versus your buyout. Now the buyout sheet's already set up for you where you could see you put in the contractor rate based on the budget and it calculates what the over under is. And you can do that for each specific trade. And then it also tracks all your general conditions, which is your staff and what type of people you have on the job. It can be accountants, it could be investment managers, it's, it's across the board. The next sheet is amortization on the loan. Amortization, you take a look at what the monthly cost is, where you're gonna be after your first year, second year, third year, as far as what's owed on the loan, so that you could track 
your mortgage reduction return. I then want to show you the actual setup of the project where we show you the construction, the land cost was 1.62, construction cost was 8.9, soft cost 2.3. We had originally estimated around a $13 million project. You then get into FF&E, that is the furniture, fixtures, and equipment that we purchased in the building. There is a cost comparison, which is so important in the scheme of things. You want to be continuously comparing your costs, as you can see here. We were comparing a construction cost across the board. And then here's all the soft costs that we expended through a certain point. And then the sources and uses, that, that's the key and how your flow of funds and the closing analysis. If you walk down this, you'll see all the uses, all the sources line by line this lays out every item that was in your project budget is carried through to your sources and uses and then once you have total uses it zeroes out total sources equals total uses then we tracked cost to date in a table so at the closing we can get paid back and then the closing analysis is where you see how many, how much proceeds you're gonna get at the closing and what the flow of funds are. Now, the next sheet is something that I want you to focus on. This is the, this is the bridge water equity. And this is, you know, how we essentially kept track of the money coming in in the different tranches. There was an initial offering, there was then a second round offering, then a third round. In many investment strategies, there are tranches where the money comes in in phases. Now, I mentioned to you earlier, and I learned this from my mentor building skyscrapers, is you have to build all investments on paper. When we're building a skyscraper during pre-construction, we are literally finding the exact trade cost, how long it's going to take to fabricate exterior panels how many weeks it's going to take to install an elevator. What are the long lead items? How long does it take to get the elevator motor to the job site after approvals? What equipment has to be landed on the roof when the large crane is there? All of these items have to be thought through prior to getting started. You can't start building a skyscraper or any type of project and figure it out in midstream. It just doesn't work. So the key is building your investments on paper. Why? Because if you don't build it on paper, how can you get prepared to manage all the systems that you've developed? Now, I want to show you the result of these systems. There's a reason why we have all these systems. It's to get a result. I want to show you what I created in 2005. It was called Partners in Progress. This is the modern wealth building formula in action before I even knew what I was doing. I had done very well in New York City construction and I decided to do some stick build in New Jersey. That led to a 52 unit transit village and a hotel and then I did a bunch of houses, but it started out with a company called Partners in Progress and it was a protocol. This is where I used the top down learning and I came to New Jersey and I started doing residential and period people were like, who is this guy? Let's just give him deals. He's going to close. He's going to get it done. And I had such a gravitational pull. And the program I set up, which I'm now giving to you, is my Partners in Progress program, which starts with, let me just show it to you. I mean, it's pretty exciting here. Let's take a look at it. This is the Partners in Progress protocol, secured annual return on your investment. A cover letter, very simple, shows you Everything that's included in the package, which is the Partners in Progress Limited Liability Company, where people could invest in. And then it started where it had the executive summary. The executive summary laid out all the items that we've talked about in previous summaries so that the executives can see what they're getting themselves into early on in the process. It shows the management team. It talks about frequently asked questions. It talks about our track record. What skin is in the game? And the actual protocol is where it shows the investment analysis, 
the mortgage and security agreement, the commercial note, the property survey. These are all items that you clearly shown to you right here. There's nothing to figure out. There's nothing to figure out. The, the system, whether it's about insurance, the deed, the appraisal, I've spelled it all out in the modern wealth building formula. And there's a series of process masteries that we've been continuously working on, deal sourcing, funding, the value add programs. You know, what would you do if you had to turn over renovated units? How are you gonna lead your team? What is the investment thesis? Accounting, legal, administration. Are you firing on all cylinders? See, at the end of the day, you wanna show deal flow. You wanna show track record. You wanna show skin in the game. If you can't do that initially, and there's a gap that you have to fill, you have to joint venture with people. You have to merge ecosystems with people that have the experience. The modern wealth building formula is about using other people's experience and other people's money. If you don't have it, if you have the experience and the money, the system is going to show you some micro distinctions that are going to make a huge difference. This system has been proven for every type of real estate. It started on a skyscraper. It was proven on a commercial building in reverse. We then did residential projects. We then did several residential projects. And no matter what sector you're in or what market, you're going to need money and people are going to want to invest. And that's where the investing protocol comes in. You're going to be ready for this game. I just want to tell you. I've put my heart and soul into training you. You have the best of the best information. Now, I want you to take the top-down thinking, and I want you to facilitate the formula. There's a lot of things we talked about today, and this is where we're getting down to the finale. I want you to take out your scorecard, and I want you to look at facilitating the formula. I want you to step back. I want you to go through each of the items. Look at the tools in your tool belt. Look at your dream team. Have you set up funding? Do you have a finding facility? Are you clear on your investment criteria? How are you gonna get deal flow? Are you ready to fire on all cylinders? I believe that you are. I know you are, and I know you can do it. And now is the time to get started. Facilitating the formula is key. You know how to reach me. Ken at KenVanLu.com. If you have questions at this stage and you're struggling, and if you're serious about being successful, then take action. Take massive action. I know that probably only 10% of you have gotten to this point. You are the chosen one. Keep going, make a difference, take action, write another list. I'm gonna tell you to put this course together, it wasn't easy. It took a lot of diligence, a lot of tenacity. Never giving up on my dream to pay it forward and to bring you to your greatness, to leave you with more power and freedom and self-expression and peace of mind so you can have another stream of revenue, so you can create a legacy for your family, take care of your parents, do whatever you want in life, make a decision today. The decisions you make today are gonna to give you the results you want in the future. That's the key. And you need structure for fulfillment. And I truly believe the modern wealth building formula is sustainable and it applies to any business in the world. Start today using it in real estate and go out there and find your first deal. Use other people's money or use your own money and put it to work in a way where you are the leader. You facilitate the deal. You're the general partner, the GP, making the bulk of the profit, controlling the deal, having some fun. Every day in real estate is different. You're going to love it. You'll have a passion for it. And you can learn from no matter where you are right now, whatever skill set you have, it has a low cost to entry. 
There's a lot of people that are going to help you. And right now, I want you to facilitate the formula and make it a great day. Let's go to the next lesson. Wow, now you've seen a little bit of the journey and adopting the modern wealth building formula offers a multitude of benefits. It streamlines the investment process, mitigates risk, and maximizes returns. By following this formula, you are not just investing in real estate, you are investing in a systemized approach that elevates your potential for success. This formula and ecosystem is your guide to building a sustainable and profitable real estate portfolio. What propelled Brooke, Tom, and Jeremy to success in real estate investing was not just their ambitions or dreams, it was the specialized guidance and strategic insight that they received. This mentorship provided them with the tools and confidence needed to navigate the complexities of the market, leverage their unique strengths, and pursue the opportunities that unmatched their goals. Through personalized breakthrough sessions and tailored strategies, they were able to transform their aspirations into tangible success. Through extensive research and personal trials, we've honed this formula into an essential tool that's ready for you to yield at the right moment. It's been battle tested by hundreds and is a must have in your arsenal for navigating the complex world of real estate investing. Consider that a very good mentor will take 10 years off your learning, so why reinvent the wheel? I love these two quotes about mentoring. Our chief want in life is somebody who will make us do what we can, Ralph Waldo Emerson. A mentor is someone who sees more talent and ability within you than you see in yourself and help brings it out of you, Bob Proctor. Every successful individual I know has a mentor, someone who didn't just pave the way but also held them accountable enable them to make significant impact. My advice is straightforward. Don't go at it alone. Sidestep the exhaustive trial and error. It's notorious time thief. I speak from experience. To reach greatness, seek out a mentor who has not only achieved success themselves, but has a track record of elevating others to similar heights. Find the finest mentor you can and commit to the journey with them. To recap, the journey to mastering real estate investing through the Modern Wealth Formula is both challenging and rewarding. It requires dedication, the right mindset, and a willingness to learn and adapt. But with the right mentorship, a proven system, and accountability, the path to real estate success is not just a possibility, it's a probability. Remember, the true value in this formula lies not just in the wealth it could help you build, but in the knowledge, confidence, and legacy it enables you to create. Thank you for embarking on this journey with me. Let's transform your real estate aspirations into reality. You will have a choice after we determine your goals with practical experience and resources to help achieve your results. You know you need this, but how do you want to do it? You have two options. Option one, opting the hard way in fields like investment or business decision making means a long challenging journey or self-learning often marked by costly mistakes and setbacks. While this path can eventually lead to a deep understanding, it's fraught with risks and inefficiencies. Instead, leverage structured education, mentorship, or guidance allows for a more streamlined and less perilous route to success. Learning from others' experience and expertise not only helps in avoiding common pitfalls, but it also accelerates the overall journey towards achieving your goals making it a preferable alternative to going at it alone. Or option two, the easy way, get help. Embarking on a new venture or seeking to improve your financial acumen can be a daunting process, rife with complexity and uncertainty. With our mentorship program, you sidestep the harsh lessons of trial and error by leveraging our wealth and expertise and experience. Imagine progressing further and faster by learning from our resources and success and mistakes, not just in theory, but through actionable insights and personal guidance. By choosing us, you not just gain a mentor, you are gaining an ally who will provide you support and direction at every juncture, ensuring that your journey is not just successful, but also efficient and rewarding. You've also taken the first step by reaching out to us. Let's continue that journey together, making every step count towards your ultimate goals. The good news is that you already made the right choice. You took the first step on the easy path. You booked a call with us. Well done. 
Here's how we'll pave the way to your results during our call by mapping out your current position, envisioning your desired destination, and charting the necessary steps to bridge the gap between the two. Clarity is the cornerstone of progress and our conversation will be dedicated to illuminating the path ahead. As we draw the call to a close, the pivotal question will address the compatibility, assessing whether our program aligns with your ambitions. This isn't just about finding any fit, it's about discovering the right fit to catalyze significant advancements in your journey. And because almost everyone wants to continue down the second path after the call, that's why we created the Modern Wealth Building Formula How to Master Real Estate Investing's Ecosystem. This is a premium personalized group consulting partnership, an ecosystem that is life-changing, which gives you the following just to name a few. Mindset acuity. Cultivating the keen mindset acuity is foundational as it sharpens your focus and prepares you to navigate the complexities of real estate investing. The modern matrix offers you a structured approach to evaluating opportunities and optimizing your investment strategies with precision and efficiency. We help you set clear investment goals, which are crucial. It gives you the direction to your endeavors and provides a benchmark for measuring your success. From building high rises, I teach a little bit about top-down thinking. This method broadens your perspective, encourages strategic planning, and prioritization that aligns with overarching vision. Investment criteria is super critical because it defines the criteria and is a proactive step that streamlines decision-making and ensures alignment with your financial objectives. We help you master your money hook pitch, which dramatically increases your ability to secure funding by captivating potential investors with your value proposition. You learn how to assemble a dream team, which creates a synergy that leverages diverse expertise, driving your projects towards success with a collaborative effort. And that's just a few. There's over 30 items in the Modern Wealth Building formula and much, much more that you learn. And once you unlock the proven framework of the Modern Wealth Building Formula, you will embark in a journey that you won't believe. Navigating deals with no money down, harnessing the art of negotiation, building a portfolio that grows in value for long-term benefit, not just immediate returns. You'll develop an ecosystem of professionals that amplify your success and provide expert guidance at no additional cost. It will transform your skepticism and confidence, and each step of the formula will prove its worth in real-world applications. You will achieve financial gains and satisfaction of mastering a craft that could benefit you and your family for generations. So let me give you a value proposition. The Lifetime Program has a 15-minute onboard and progress call with me. Can't wait to talk to you. Personalized group consulting three times a month. That's an annual value of 50 grand. Six hours per month at 695, 72 hours a year. Lifetime partnership and access to the ecosystem, which is invaluable. Lifetime access to my digital library, which is invaluable and includes the Modern Wealth Building Formula digital program at $9,997. It has digital bonus programs, financial freedom protocol, 40 lessons, how to master residential real estate investing, $5,997. And my real estate development made easy program, $100,000 in value. Every piece of work I ever did, I valued at $19,997. That's $86,000 in your first year. And thereafter, $50,000 in annual value. And now you can see why this is all you need to get the results you want in real estate and how much value you are receiving. That's why this program gets such incredible results for our clients repeatedly. As I said, there are few people in the world with this knowledge and access to me. No one in the world is teaching this level of expertise to my knowledge, and no one is saying their system works 100% of the time or their money back. Give me a couple more minutes to show you how these three people found their way. Roman Franklin was employed with the New York City Fire Department. He found a path to freedom after one deal. Roman Franklin, uh, i just like to say that because of Ken Van Loo, his teaching, his guidance, he was the first person that told me. And I can believe that if you set your mind to it, you could actually do one deal that could retire you. Lo and behold, uh, it's two weeks later, I find one deal that could retire me for life. Uh, he's a great teacher. He's an action educator, and he's just an outstanding, amazing guy. And I say that from my heart. Uh, you got to listen to him. 
Brent Bowers, founder of the Land Shark, shared his gratitude for opening his eyes to potential in land development and now gives credit to me guiding him towards purchasing larger parcels of land for development. Let's hear a few words from Brent. Hey there, it's Brent Bowers with the Land Sharks. I wanted to do a quick uh, testimonial video for Ken Van Lu. Uh, I met Ken a couple years ago at a family mastermind event and we actually uh, ran the bridge together and he opened my eyes to development possibilities. I do a lot of land deals. I do a lot of seller financing and passive income land deals. Uh, but Ken showed me how to buy bigger, more expensive parcels of land that we can actually develop on. We're actually building on, we're building 38 townhomes now on 2.3 acres or 2.7 acres that we purchased in Colorado Springs. And that, that couldn't have happened without the help of Ken Van Lu. So I just wanted to give a quick shout out and thank you for this. Thank you for, Ken, for this, Ken, and uh, for showing me the way and showing me that there's way bigger possibilities too that you can do with land. Chris Rapp, a little camera shy, Chris expresses his gratitude for the mentorship and guidance he received. The mentorship boosted Chris's confidence and he transitions his career into real estate development. Thanks for all of your guidance and mentorship. In our short time working together, I have gained a lot of confidence in my pivot to becoming a real estate developer. I recently purchased a two acre commercial site here in Frederick, Maryland, and I have plans to develop a spectacular flex office building. With your help, I know I'll be able to reach my goals even faster. I'm incredibly grateful for all that you've done to challenge me and to provide me with support along this journey. Fasu, a computer specialist who came to the U.S. with $400 in a dream, and I've had the opportunity to help him. We met uh, Ken Van Lu recently through Facebook ads, and we signed up for his uh, coaching. He helped us, you know, in uh, understanding what we are holding on the properties, 10 properties, and he's uh, coming up with a very good exit strategy where we can pull out the money around $600,000 and help that money with uh, investing in multifamily apartments. That's our dream. So Ken is really helping us, you know, in realizing our dream. So let's unlock your potential and experience why our consulting program stands out. Have you ever invested in a consultant and only to find minimal benefit? You are not alone. Many individuals shared their frustration with me recounting bad experiences and wasted money. Now imagine a consulting program that delivers a genuine transformation without a hefty price tag. Let me break it down for you. When hiring professionals like architects, engineers, or lawyers, their hourly rates can range from $275 up to $1,200 I paid for a lawyer. And it starts with a retainer anywhere from five to $10,000 for their services. In comparison, my hourly rate stands at $695 an hour. So opting for services for me as you know, hourly or an owner's rep, as an owner's rep, you'd incur a monthly fee of anywhere from 10 to 25,000, potentially adding up to 250,000 per year. This is a considerable investment for any consultant, and you have to have a project to drive it. Alternatively, by joining our ecosystem, you gain direct access to me and our group's professionals at no additional cost. Contrast this with the current marketplace, where high-profile gurus like Tony Robbins, my buddy, command fees as steep as $250,000 for their top-tier program. Yet their inherent limitation in such services is specialized. Many coaches specialize narrowly in one skill set, necessitating additional programs and you know for different needs. You know, this method overlooks the comprehensive fundamentals you need to become a true master in real estate investing. It's capable of adapting as you learn and your path evolves. So consider the dilemma of the person I spoke with who invested heavily in a guru's advice, five years on, remains entangled with unanswered questions and no real deal to show for it. This is not an isolated incident, but a pervasive issue in the world of coaching and mentorship. And I'm curious, are you seeing any of these roadblocks that may be hindering your progress? Well, you found a model that's different. We offer specialized focus and effective consulting that promises results. Our program is designed to not just teach, but to also adapt to your evolving interest, ensuring continuous, relevant support. We are confident in our methodology so much that we back it with a guarantee. If you actively participate, we guarantee results. 
Our approach is clear, no filler, no ambiguity, just concrete, actionable strategies tailored specifically to you. So now it's time for a straightforward decision. With specialized consulting, proven results, and a risk-free guarantee, the choice is clear. Embrace the opportunity to maximize your potential. Join our ecosystem and notice a palpable difference as we navigate the intricacies of real estate investing together. It's not just a smart move, it's a no-brainer. Remember, success isn't about hype, it's about targeted growth. So let's rewrite your story together. We don't receive many questions, especially after the information I've just provided. However, we do have a couple of frequently asked questions. How long will it take to close my first deal? Embarking on a new venture can be a daunting task, but with our tailored mentorship program, you can navigate the complexities of real estate with confidence and speed. Our diverse experience shows that while outcomes can vary, ranging from groundbreaking deals in as little as 60 days to a remarkable seven deals in nine months, Success is not just possible, it's attainable. We take pride in guiding skeptics like a once doubtful lawyer who conquered the challenge of buying homes with no money down toward proving the effectiveness of our methods. By joining us, you are not just learning strategies, but you are adapting proven frameworks to your pace, ensuring that your journey in real estate investment is not just successful, but it also accelerates at the rate that aligns with your unique situation and goals. What time commitment is needed for the course? Regarding the course, the video trainings require approximately one to one and a half hours per week and it's over in a couple months. Additionally, there are three group coaching sessions per month lasting up to two hours. You have the flexibility to attend any or all of these sessions, whether you wanna actively participate, ask a quick question, or simply listen with your camera off and mute on, it's entirely up to you. And how much does it cost is the big question. Based on the initial and annual value, if you are serious, the cost is negligible with substantial discounts and several finance alternatives to make it work for you. If you don't have negligible money to invest in yourself, you are most likely not the right fit for our program. In either event, if you're over the first hurdle of understanding the difference of value versus cost, it should be a no-brainer. Think about it. If your time is worth 200 an hour and I save you 100 hours, which is easy, that's 20,000 right there. We will discuss the cost of the lifetime program on our call. You will be extremely surprised with the price. So before our call, please remember, allocate 60 minutes of uninterrupted time, choose a quiet space free from distractions, phone silent, no driving or multitasking, engage with an open mind ready to step outside your comfort zone for tangible results, have materials ready for note taking to ensure full engagement and avoid rescheduling. With that in mind, I'm eager for you to experience what promises to be a transformative call, just as it's been for countless others. Let's make it remarkable. Your energy can make all the difference. Thank you for staying with me to the end of this video. Looking forward to our call. See you soon and make it a great day.